Hey, I'm Josh, and this is my story. I went to a Christian school from preschool until I graduated and was brought up in a Christian home. VeggieTales was always on as a kid. Now, because of this, I accepted Jesus as my Lord and Savior at a very young age. I don't think I could even read yet, but I could already recite a dozen Bible verses and the entire Christmas story. It wasn't until sometime in high school that my faith became my own and not just something I had grown up with. Thankfully, I had some great mentors that showed me what it meant to be a man of God and how to live out my faith. It was around this time that I started coming to Oasis and very quickly, I started volunteering in Upstreet as one of the worship leaders. I absolutely love getting up on stage and jumping around and praising Jesus with all the kids up there. Before long, I really started to feel like I belonged to this community of people. I even began to feel God calling me to consider that maybe he could use me to touch the hearts and minds of others, that he could use me for something bigger than myself. Unfortunately, with the onset of the COVID-19 pandemic, life became a little rocky. I was still trying to volunteer where I could online, but it just wasn't the same as being on stage with the kids. Things were starting to blow up in my personal life too. And with lots of uncertainties all around me, I was starting to feel farther and farther away from that calling and from Jesus himself. My anxiety got the better of me. And for a while, I stopped coming to church completely. I felt like Jesus wasn't with me anymore. And if that was true, why should I bother? And then, a couple years ago, I met this incredibly brave kid named Ethan. He was fighting leukemia, and his dream was to meet Spider-Man, which, through my job entertaining at kids' parties, I was lucky enough to be able to fulfill for him. I had the amazing opportunity to meet him and his family and to be a part of something bigger than myself. I got to help create the special dream come true moment for Ethan, and God used Ethan's story to change my life forever. Ethan reminded me of that calling from God on my life and his courage in the face of illness reminded me of my favorite Bible verse. Joshua 1 verse 9 says, Have I not commanded you? Be strong and courageous. Do not be afraid. Do not be discouraged. For the Lord your God will be with you wherever you go. If this brave little kid could keep on fighting despite uncertainties going on in his life, I knew I could as well. I know that Ethan is in heaven, where one day we'll meet again. A couple months ago, I started coming back to Oasis and volunteering in Upstreet on Sundays, as well as attending the young adults environment, the living room on Thursday nights. There, I joined a small group and instantly felt like I belonged. We laugh, we cry, we joke around, and share in deep, meaningful conversations that have strengthened my relationship with Jesus to a point it's never been before. Sure, there are still uncertainties and anxieties in my life, but I am confident that Jesus will be with me through it all. And that's why I'm here today, to publicly declare my love for Jesus Christ through baptism.